Hi everybody, welcome back to Way Too Late TV. I am your host Sam, and today on Bite Size Battletech, we'll be going right back into the frozen tundra of the Carthage system with Richter Scale Company to do a uh, an escort mission. Uh, everyone's favorite. <laughs> uh, it's uh, worth about 1.2 million C bills uh, at max uh, max cash or five uh priority salvage and 23 regular salvage um i think we'll be somewhere in the middle um it's called blown operation so you know things are a little bit foobar let's head over to the big board and i'll explain a little bit further way too late tv all right let's turn on the cam that's right Let's bring down the top. All right. Now then. Uh, blown operation. It is for the Federated Suns. Um, less than an hour ago, we lost contact with a covert team tasked with infiltrating a Taurian facility. The only reason for them not to respond is if their operation was blown by discovery or counterintelligence. The research materials they were meant to collect are extremely important and we can't afford to lose them. We need you to make a rapid and immediate deployment to the facility and get our people and their cargo to safety. When I hear rapid and immediate, I'm thinking no intel and expect nasty surprises, Commander. You know, that's right, Oliveira. But we're gonna do it anyway. Because that's just the company we are. All right. So we're going to negotiate here. I think we're going to go straight down the middle. 651k and 3 priority, 13 regular salvage. We're going to get 6 uh, rep with the Federated Sons and lose 5 with the Torian Concordant. The Torians can go screw themselves. I really hate them. I dislike the Torians greatly. Um, their, their chunk of space I really could, couldn't give a crap about. Um... Everyone has a uh, a disliked faction that plays this game for a long enough time, and mine are the Torians. I don't know why, I just do. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. So, we're going in, um, bringing Senti, Blackjack, Crab, and Slurms. Um, Glare is in the hospital for a few days, longer. So I'm going to bring Archangel for the Centurion and swap out Archangel and Deckhand. So Deckhand is going to be in the Centurion. The Centurion, because of Master Tactician, will be going on uh, Initiative 4. Everyone else on Initiative 3. Slurms McKenzie will be going uh, with a 4 Tactical, or 4 Tactics pilot, which... Uh, not ideal, but it gets the job done. So uh, the crab is with a TAC-9 pilot. Uh, TAC-9 meaning that uh, they have called shot mastery. Uh, Long Shadow has called shot mastery, meaning that uh, there is a, uh, the, he has an 18% shot for a headshot uh, with uh, called shot. Uh, shot, shot, shot. And Earthquake, my uh, player character. Um, very, very close to having um, called shot mastery. But um, let's... Let's head down to the planet. Mercenary force, you are entering a restricted Torian area. Withdraw or you will be fired on. Yeah, they weren't surprised at all to see us. This sounds like a blown operation to me. Agreed. Commander, once you've dealt with the response force, you'll find our employer's people here at this facility. Try not to get any of them shot or stepped on. Good luck. Alright. I'm there. And we have enemy contact. I'm receiving you. Going. That is a commando, and they missed horribly. 
Okay, that's good. Ready to rock. Centurion, just going to uh, aim and fire. Ooh, baby. Blackjack, move forward. Aim, fire. Alright, not much in the way of be being hit there, but um, I'm going to move forward. Crab with the lasers. Goodbye. Hit me with that graphic. And then Slurmzy, just going after that catapult. Oh, it's, uh, it's in cover, seriously in cover, so that's why it only hit for one damage apiece. Okay, the crab took some damage from those PPCs, those projectile particle cannons. Centurion is going to fire on the, uh, non-covered catapult. Missed with the uh, UAC-10, which is a shame because those things, those things hurt like the Dickens. Right, I didn't see what that was. It's a an enforcer. I'm not too too familiar with those. Let's take a look at it. L laser, S laser, AC-10. Okay, that's annoying enough to want to destroy. But I'm um, going to move over here with the crab. Get the unstable things off and just open fire on the catapult. Alright, that right leg of it is uh, ready to come off. So I'm going to move over here and actually fire at the right leg. 34% shot. And I missed, but Missed the right leg. I, I still hit the damn thing. Commander. All right. Uh, Slurmzy, just go, just go hog wild. All right. That's a knockdown. It's back on its feet, of course. It's going after the crab again. Much more of this. All right, all right. Let's see here. Senti's gonna move back a bit and just fire. You know they can never go for that right leg when you want them to, but that's okay. Enforcer going after the Senti, and that's fine. That's fine. Oh, you're fine. Alright, that takes off the left arm. The left torso as well, so that's a PPC, a medium laser, and a machine gun gone. Yes, Commander. Crab's turn. There goes the entire other right torso, so it's just a head on a stick right now. And then Slurmzy's gonna finish it off. Goodbye. Now that enforcer is getting annoying, so let's take it out. Well, start taking it out at least. It's in the brush though, so as you can see here, Forest, 20% damage reduction, Tundra Biome, Heat Sinking, and Cover, 20% damage reduction. So, it's got 40% damage reduction, um, 20% maybe. Ah, who knows. Let's just say it didn't take full damage. Okay, not much damage in the way of the 
blackjack there. Rolling. The crab, though, I'm going to take a uh, aim shot. Let's see, 81 and 85. So the right torso is the uh, least armored. Got it, Commander. Take a seat. Reporting critical hit. There goes that AC-10. I'm your Spaniel. And then Slurmsy's just gonna aim and fire. Oh, the... That's not a good shot with the uh, missiles. 40% and 50%. Oh, well. Move right there. On my way. Oh, well. It still gives some stability damage. Yep. Which is, honestly... All you can really ask for, and sometimes... In some situations like this. Okay. Now we're talking. That is some severe cent center torso damage. It's got 55 structure left. Not armor, structure. Standing by. I'm just going to send the crab after it. Firing full complement on enemy. Oh. Solid connection on that one. Didn't do what I thought it was going to do, but it did almost enough. 35 damage left on that center torso. And let's just... Let's just end this. Alright, now... I have a feeling that we're going to follow that road, so I'm going to pre-move my mechs over there, and then we're going to, uh, get our... Shit, we're glad to see you folks! Okay, that was a horrible gunshot approximation. I was worried we'd have to walk home! We have an LC marked for you. Is your team ready to move? Everyone who's left, we're mounting up now, muffled explosion. Let's move, people! Alrighty. Ally turn. Alright, we need to... haul ass here. To keep up with the, uh... Escort. Oh yeah, just... Go through the trees, that's fine. Some drivers. Yeah, if anything, they're gonna come from over there, or... I guess? I don't know. Oh, am I Kreskin? I'm there. That's an old, old reference. Ask your parents. Hey boss, I'm seeing more context. Whatever these guys stole must be important. There they are, okay. They are out of bounds, too. Crap. Alright, going after the lo locust. Okay, the locust is dead. And the trebuchet's back in bounds. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, now I'm going to actually go after everything. Or not go after everything. A is hit, B is hit, and I just have to get C off of the... C off of the uh, ATVs and onto me, and that will happen right now. Okay. Waiting for orders. Okay, best shot on that griffin. Firing. The objective is secured, Commander. Okay. Now we can either evac or teach these teach these assholes a lesson. And 
I like teaching these assholes a lesson. I like those odds a little better than anything else, so I'm going to go 18% uh, shot on the head. Okay. That has five structure left on the head. Uh-oh. Okay. I'm ready. And now we're going straight for the... Okay, now we can't go straight for the head. Now we can go straight for the head. 18% and goodbye. Oh, hell, yeah. oh, hell yes. Target neutralized. All right, that left leg is looking worse for wear. We're going to vigilance and uh going to move back into the brush and we're going to go after the javelin. No, the griffin. Okay. Standing by. Slurmsy's going to move into the brush. And go after the griffin. It's go time. It is go time. Okay. Confirm. I got you. Centurion gonna vigilance. Attack on the griffin. Structure exposed on that right torso. Blackjack is going to go after the griffin because... Compound. It's gone down. It's on its ass. Waiting for orders. Crabby Crab Crab going in right about there. Got it, Commander. Going after that crab. Or not crab, the griffin. It is a crab, but it's going after the griffin. Griffin's uh, right torso is down. It has one health left. And Slurmsy's going to finish it off with that center torso. Farewell, sweet prince. Senti's just going to move forward. Going to vigilance. And going to precision strike the hell out of that thing's head. Didn't take a shot to the head. Did take one to the right torso, though. And it's going after the crab, which is great, because the crab barely had any damage on it. Blackjack, just fire away. Both its torsos are uh, taking some orders. serious damage. Ready for orders. Um, let's just go for it. Jump jet destroyed. Well, that's Target useless. And Slurmsy just fire. Alright, head hit. Down to two of three health. Yeah, just keep going after the crab. That's fantastic. I love you for it. Who loves you, baby? Confirm. Copy that. Precision strike right in the uh, head. Oh yeah, center torso, left leg, left torso, left arm, right torso. It's it's a pair of legs now. Or no, one leg. One leg. With one headlight. Well done, you managed to wipe the op four out. I can do an extract right now. No need to get to our planned LZ. Just relax. Alright, here we go. Uh contract payment increased by twenty percent due to destroy enemy blocking force and ensure all convoy units survive during extraction. Um so seven eighty one two hundred C bills. Um, a little bit of paint chippage. Um, let's see what we got here. We got a whole ass enforcer, a whole ass javelin 10A, 
And what else? I'm gonna go with the trebuchet. Piece of a trebuchet. And I got a whole ass trebuchet. No, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, so whole ass enforcer, one piece of a griffin, whole ass javelin, two pieces of trebuchet, and a piece of a locust 1M. Uh, AC5, LRM15, a PPC, a small laser, and five jump jets, which I'm going to sell right now. A value of 9,673,331 C-bills. All this could be yours if the price is right. And it is. We will be going over to the other big board just to wrap things up. Way too late TV. I want to thank you all for joining me here on Way Too Late TV. I am your host, Sam, and this has been Bite Size Battletech, uh, third episode in a row. Um, I'm, I am still working on the uh, Final Fantasy XIV Endwalker stuff, but these are uh, a lot easier to edit, a lot shorter to edit. They take usually about two to three hours a piece instead of the literal days that the Endwalker stuff takes per episode. So you understand why I'm kind of working up momentum to get these going. Anyway, join me any day of the week, any time of the day at waytoolatetv.com right there, waytoolatetv.com. Uh, for all your way too late TV needs, it's got my Twitter, it's got my YouTube, it's got playlists for all the series that I do, and a couple other bits and bobs that I'm sure you'll find entertaining. It is my link tree, so it's just got, you know, links to all these things, um, and it's uh, fun to look at too. So uh, go over there. Um, also, uh, like and subscribe the video if you uh, liked it or feel the need to subscribe. Um, if you didn't, then um, I'm sorry. Anyway, uh, I will talk to you next time. Good night, my night owls. Sleep well when you get there. Way too late.